mfanyabiashara na mwanasiasa Jimmy Wanjigi hatimaye aliachiliwa huru baada ya kuwasilisha ombi katika mahakama kuzuia kushtakiwa kwake katika kesi ya sakata ya ardhi ya kima cha shilingi bilioni moja nukta mbili. Wanjigi alilaumu ofisa wakuu serikalini kwa madhila yake akisisitiza kuwa operesheni ya jana ilimfika kwa sababu ya azma yake ya kisiasa. Jimmy Wanjigi aliibuka kutoka kwenye seli za mahakama ya milimani kujibu tuhma za ulaghai kotini baada ya kukesha katika kituo cha polisi cha Kamkunje jijini Nairobi. Mbele ya hakimu Bernard Ochoi, mawakili wa Jimmy wakiongozwa na Willis Oteno walipinga vikali hatua ya kukamatwa kwake wakisisitiza kuwa mahakama kuu ilikuwa tayari imetoa amri ya kutokamatwa wala kushtakiwa kwa Wanjigi. Ochoi akibaki bila jingine ila kumwachilia huru Wanjigi na mkewe nzisa wanaodaiwa kumlaghai mnunuzi wa shamba kima cha shilingi milioni hamsina sita huku kesi hiyo ikitarajiwa kutajwa mbele ya jaji wa mahakama kuu Anthony Mrima Februari tisa mwaka huu. Ochoi hata hivyo aliamuru washtakiwa wenza kujiwasilisha mahakamani tarehe 24 mwezi huu. Na alipoachiliwa mfanyabiashara huyu mashuhuri na mgombea wa rais wa chama cha ODM alishtumu rais Uhuru Kenyatta na kinara wa ODM Raila Odinga kwa madhila yake. In March In fact March 9 2018 My friend Raila Amolo Odinga went and had a shanshik with that master he went and had a handshake with that master and when he had that handshake with that master he went alone wanjigi akisema kuwa matatizo yake yalisababishwa na kile alikitaja kuwa usaliti kutoka kwa udinga kwa kufanya makubaliano na rais uhuru kenyata hata baada ya wanjigi na wenzake kumwapisha to tell us today that that is what you're going to follow is a big betrayal to those who have espoused the ideals which you have said you follow mfanyabiashara huyu akidokeza kuwa matamshi yake katika mkutano wa kisiasa katika eneo la Yata ndio yaliyosababisha madhila yake wiki hii babu wajigi is only here because he spoke on saturday on these issues had he not appeared in the function he did in Yata i don't think he would have been prosecuted and i think that's uh... Hapo awali maandamano ya vijana wanaomuunga mkono wa njigi nje ya mahakama yalitibuliwa na maafisa wa kuzima ghasia kwa vitu wa machozi mambo yakawa mguni ponye hata hivyo hapo baadaye walirejea na kuhutubiwa na wanjigi alipotoka mahakamani Hassan Mugambi Citizen